Hello and welcome to the shorter term update on dollar sterling. Cables pull back to the previous 156.85 high and therefore overlap at a time when we're looking for the dollar generally to rally. So has it topped just short of a possible C equals 61.8% of A at 158.05 and just short of the 38.2% retracement? It could have done, but what do we know? First, deferring to the medium term, we've been looking for a wider 153 to 160 consolidation. Second, we do have two five-wave rallies in a row. Third, it's bugged me that the first drop to low 55s was a five-wave followed by a three-wave to new highs, and therefore that could have been a B-wave high that still hasn't produced a C equals A target, which is 159.15. So, as channel support and a possible overlap of 156.45 now holds a likely test, cables should make a final attempt to break the 158. 158.35 resistance and spike hard but briefly to a band of resistance starting at 159.15 at C equals A, 159.65 the former C equals A to the 160.15 the 50% retracement. Given our dollar view though, how is this possible? The answer might lie with Euro sterling, but a loss though of 156.45 increases the threat of an early breakdown through the 155.45 pivot to retest the 152.70 consolidation lows. Good luck and have a great day.